Board members, Jafar, Ra, Patel, Perez, Rodriguez, Shore, Toli, and Rubello. At this time, we're going to open up the public portion of the meeting. The rules of the quorum in effect. Everyone will have five minutes. Anyone that wishes to speak will have five minutes to speak. Anybody that disrupts them during that time or disrupts the meeting in any way will be asked to leave. Larry Weinstein, 7414 4th Avenue. Good evening. The reason that the teacher's contract has not been approved in six or seven months is because Mayor Sacco, who is in control, total control, runs the North Bergen Board of Ed. And he's trying to steal money from the North Bergen, from the residents of North Bergen. Only a couple of meetings ago, Mayor Sacco received a $40,000 stipend approved by each board member and funded by the people of North Bergen. The worst part is that you are just tools for the most corrupt organization in the state of New Jersey. And Mayor Sacco, political corrupt organization. Please let me be loud and clear to every single person on this stage. You will soon be before a grand jury. And when that time comes, you will wish you did not do Mayor Sacco's dirty work. Regardless of the huge salaries that you and your family members have been taking as a reward for Mayor Sacco's corruption, you will wish that you will never be part of the most corrupt organization in the state of New Jersey. I also want to give you one example. Sacco has been in the school system to steal millions of dollars. And only last month you approved at your January meeting an $8,000 stipend pertaining to the suspension rate and a $40,000 stipend because the ELA scores went up in grammar schools. $48,000 for Nick Sacco. This was just done for him because he's going out in June and he's going to take the most money he can from the Board of Education. Many of the North Bergen teachers have worked hard, studied and graduated from the best schools. Our teachers are professionals. But in North Bergen, if you want to be a teacher, you have to ring doorbells and be involved politically. In North Bergen, you don't get the proper supplies. Teachers have told me that they have to share computers and books. But Mayor Sacco, who is a cancer to the school system, is taking from the people of North Bergen with his extras, his stipends, and his bloated salaries. He's taking over $330,000, $330,000 only from the Board of Education. He's the highest paid administrator in the state of New Jersey. But you're not granting the teachers a fair contract. I am here today because of the disastrous problems in our school system. Teachers are forced to buy political tickets and ring doorbells instead of teaching our children, which is the foundation of our society. You force them to work politics, go door to door, instead of being treated like professionals. You misuse them. Sacco is for Sacco, and everything is based on how many votes the teachers deliver for the Sacco political machine. The reason I am here is because Sacco is manipulating the teacher's contract only for his own personal gain. I'm here to support the teachers, and please grant them a fair and honest contract. Thank you. Yay. You want to talk me at the mic, Nick? Because the man yeah. is just lying. Talk to the mic, I can't hear. Talk to the mic. Use the mic. Use the mic. And everybody on this board knows I'm that I'm going to talk to And they know that Mayor right. Sacco, I'm run against me again. I'll you're the most again. corrupt politician in the state yes. of New Jersey. Yes. Yes. You are yes. 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 Yes.
Your children can't come to school here. They live in Franklin Lake. You have a poor school school system, and you have bad teachers. I'm sorry. Are you saying they're bad teachers? I'm sorry. Are you saying they're bad teachers? They the bad school, school no school supply. Stand on New Jersey. He goes to both of the high school. And he has a boss. And he's going to get to the students. specifics and I told them I could not give them specifics and then you just outlined the entire scope of our negotiations things that we had not told any of our members and that is complete violation of the confidentiality agreement so therefore I don't feel that I have to be bound by that as well the board made us a offer in, ja in June of $4.6 million over the course of two years. We agreed to that. The board then said it made a mistake, but never told us what the mistake was. So then we were told to go for three years and a little something. Our treasurer went back, he came back with another, another, um, uh, Salary guide, thank you. Salary guide for $4.8 million. Then we were told that was too high, that it was based on compounding, which was a lie. It was never based on compounding. It was always based on the amount of money that we received, which is the way it has always been done in over 50 years. Now it's been changed. So now in the course of that, it's been changed. So we go back and we take off another $200,000. But now you want masters plus 45 and masters plus 60. However, you have a vision statement, and in the vision statement it says, we envision the North Bergen School District as a place where students will be educated through the use of innovative techniques and multifaceted resources by educators who are constantly improving their craft to deliver instruction. Another thing is we tentatively agreed to Monday meetings. We did not agree to Monday meetings. So far, this year, our Monday meetings have not been productive. This past Monday, the English department and the math department sat through an exact same se uh, seminar that we already received earlier in January. 
So that is completely another falsehood. We have asked the Board of Education to come back to the table in an ad. The board, we asked, we took money off our offer. The board said, we're not taking any money off. Now we want this, this, and this. We say that the teachers need to be paid for the work the teachers do, just like the administrators get paid for the work that they do. that we get for doing work after school and reducing it to $50. That's a 33% reduction. Yet, the head of the basic skills department makes $375 an hour for a Saturday program that the teachers are making $75 for. So there's a big disparagement. So we are asking that the teachers who are members of this community are given a fair shake and given a fair contract. for over six months and uh, it's time to uh, let the Board of Education know that they're wrong. What they're doing is to support Nick Sacco and his uh, personal agenda and we're here to voice our opinion. Thank you.